Well, we're back in our chosen paradise on the island of Guam. Actually, I now refer to the island as our primary paradise, and the Philippines has become our alternate paradise. It just works out better that way for both of us, and for many reasons that I will delve into in another video. But today, we are taking a walk to Ipau Beach Park via the newly renovated road that leads to the beach. This is our first walk down the new and improved road since it reopened, and today there's an event happening at the park, and it's a big one. It's the 70th anniversary of the Filipino community of Guam celebration. There are a couple of Filipino celebrities that have flown in and are set to perform this evening, and there is food, games, local entertainers, and it's just more fun for the entire family. This is an all-day event and admission is free, so we just decided to pop in and check it out. Because we didn't plan on attending this event, we had to modify our walk somewhat, taking in all the happenings here. Normally when we plan on coming to an event like this, we would bring our wagon and our chairs and we'd just camp out in the shade, relaxing with some good food and refreshments. Many times we would just stay around and catch the sunset. Today though it was a planned calorie burn. I will admit though that we almost broke down and bought something to eat, as the smell was so tempting. But I'm happy to report that we were able to resist all the good food temptations. Terry, however, could not resist spending at least a little money, and she broke down and bought a white jade bracelet. The festival made for a rather pleasant walk around, and we still logged our three miles as we got back to the house. If there's one thing I can add, Many of the attendees here were Filipino, with a few other local VIPs in attendance. I'm sure that many of those who attended were here to see their homeland celebrities. On an island where nearly 45,000 Filipinos call home, it definitely feels like being in the Philippines some days, and that's a good thing. Oh, and one other thing, the new road to the beach will definitely get a lot more use by me in the future. Uh -huh. 